just want to know, man, if you had any thoughts on the Steelers draft, if that was something that you was even still tapped in on. Oh, yeah. I mean, definitely. I mean, I was just rooting for my man, little Joey Porter, for sure. Jay, you know, I just wanted to see it. Jay, even, let's even go. Yeah. Let's you go. know, even if it wasn't with the Steelers, I was hoping it was with the Steelers, you know, yeah. and I love how we could stay in Pittsburgh. He'd been around, like, I reached out to him. Like, I'm like, man, I, he was in training camp. That's you know, what I'm saying. That, he was around. Know, going through, Absolutely, bro. Going through, going through drills, going through indie. Like, yeah, he was around. You, you would watch him. Like, Absolutely. Yeah. So, I mean, he, he's been around. So, he's really, like, pretty much home. So, that's how I'm, I'm definitely happy that it happened with Pittsburgh. But most of all, I was just rooting for him to, you know, get to the NFL and um, live his dream out. Because nah. I, I watched it, like, firsthand. Yo, without a doubt, man. I mean, that's actually kind of crazy, too. You're talking about the JPJ part coming here. I even think back then, C. Lake was your coach, and he actually left to go coach his son as well. That's what right, like, right, 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 right. Yeah, 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 family ties. Shout out to Carnell Lake, but yeah, yeah. a ton of family ties like that, bro. That right, right. But now, the, hey, hey, but like you said, though, I'm, the draft was clean, though. I like the draft. I like the draft picks they picked. Uh, definitely all the moves they made in offseason and free agency. I like it. 